And today, now May 1, 2020, and we didn't mark another anniversary of the International Workers' Day, and we they institutionalized and dedicated as we both take Tokam to take celebrate working class across the world. Traditionally, the day for the uh, it day marked for the country after the country with plenty different bunga ceremonies, parades, and other activities that we suppose to show and uh, saying a critical role we workers they play. But the outbreak for the COVID-19 don't sharply Chief the day from the color plus a fun fair all over the world. To join us now inside the phone call, now Comrade Onyeka Chris will be Deputy General the Secretary of uh, ULC. Oga de hello. Oga Chris. I de hail you well, well. Oh. Happy <laughs> Workers' yes. Day once again. Thank you so much. God bless you. Thank you. So I just want to ask you this small information. Eh? How you they see the outbreak for this COVID-19 as it take the influence uh, every, every uh, inside the human activity? And how you they feel to take Celebrate Workers' Day without the usual party and uh, every, every way they shell uh, normally on Workers' Day? Uh, my sister, this, this year's Workers' Day is uh, an unusual one. No? Mm. <laughs> Some people will say that uh, we're there for abnormal times. Not true. So, as we do for abnormal times, we wear the workers now, go try manage them, celebrate them anyhow, anyhow. Not they true. say, at all, at all, I'm the witch. Not true. So, uh, uh, things are very difficult. Uh, people, they have mm. hunger, they buy too many people. Mm. Fear, they catch too many people. Mm. Uh, so, within that context, uh, mm. uh, we they manage to use some other platform mm. to reach to different, different workers. Oh. and organizations in different different places oh. so that all of us go it's no it's a meeting of the heart oh, and the mind oh. uh, so we use the social media so that we go use them to celebrate the film oh. you know and when we celebrate it together like that we encourage ourselves as so. if, when you know tell so. your brother where they for kafanchan oh. they they healthy your brother where they the other side they healthy Not after true. the thought oh. that inspires us and gives us encouragement Okay. at this time, especially when our people mm. now then they for the front line mm. they fight COVID-19 uh, COVID so, you know, uh, you know then our people, mm. the health workers mm. our people, the aviation workers mm. our people, now then the journalists, okay. now then the die pass so, not true, now then they for road mm. uh -huh. but yet uh, uh, we are not complaining at because all. we are workers so quickly, we are the ones who so defend the world where so, they make the economy go okay Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, Chris, sorry to uh, cut you short. Eh? And so what's going be the activities where they don't plan to take mark this year on, the special way where they won't take mark this year on, and how you think say, you go be effective to the people? Ah, okay. Mm. Mm, the way where we want to take them, as we do them already, in fact, we're there for the venue where we do them. Mm. We de use the social media, okay. like uh, Facebook, Zoom, mm. uh, and Instagram. Okay. We de use them to reach out to everybody. So that we can maintain social distancing. Okay. Then a uh, few of us they gather in specific places. Okay. They also address the press. Mm. Uh, when, when we address the press, the press will carry the message you reach everywhere. Okay. You know, say in a word, the word mm. of mouth. When workers see you from where they did, they know say things they happen mm. across all the states of the federation. Now mm. so they also they gather, they also address media, they also talk. So to give hope to workers all over the nation. And to give hope to all Nigerian people that we are doing something that uh, COVID-19 must be defeated. Exactly. Okay, for a day like mm. this, uh, it is very critical to still learn about the welfare of Nigerian workers. So what will be your assessment, especially during this period of COVID-19 lockdown? Mm. Not the small wahala, not the small wahala. Mm. You know, say some people, don't mm. they plan, eh? mm. make the, the situation where they bad already. Uh, and they even the minimum wage where some of them know they pay. Mm. Some of them they plan, maybe they cut the salary of workers. Some mm. of them they even plan, maybe they no pay at all. That mm. one day wicked now. Yeah, true. Now yeah, workers uh, cost COVID-19, mm. not the weak cost them now. At all. Uh, yeah. So anybody where they try to do that kind of thing now, wicked men. So workers are already suffering. Mm. Then you want to co come up money from their salary, like, like the one where they happen for Kaduna. Mm. You know good. So mm. welfare of workers, People where they do work, if you know say that the people they do work and then they create work, mm. you go take care of them now. Are this? Now, so it's, so supposed it's critical. Mm. Mm. As we do inside this, they're supposed to send some money to us. Look, okay. we take the survivor, are this? Exactly. Uh -huh. mm. And uh, as we come out from the COVID, then they also give us money 
not could they help you? Increase our allowance, oh. hazard allowance, okay. insurance allowance, all those kind of things. Let they do it. So okay. that the workers go there healthy, workers go there happy, and help drive this economy out of recession. And then go still there happy to come back to work. So how you want uh, bring to the attention of the government the need of the workers and their, and what they really want now, where the government don't agree to relax the lockdown next week? Mm. Ah, in plenty of, okay. but what they, what thing they more important, we say, yes, we won't go back to work. Okay. The ones where they work already, let there be hazard allowance for them. Let okay. there be health insurance for them. Okay. We, when they go back to work, let them increase health insurance for us. Increase all the, um, increase the hazard allowance for us. Okay. Let them ensure that they comply with health and safety environment issues in the companies mm. uh, so that we don't go there sick. Okay. Uh -huh. Let them make sure that things are adequately prepared in the office. And it means that Ministry of Labor mm. supposed to carry their um, in, uh, factory inspectors. Mm. May they go everywhere, find out the companies they comply okay. with the laws where they make, where they put in place to avoid infection. Okay. We don't want that, you, mm, but absolutely. we want work. Nobody want that. <laughs> Nobody mm. won't die at all. So this COVID-19 yes, pandemic now, it don't be like, say, it don't shift the attention from mm. the issues of minimum wage, they come out from the minimum wage body. You they concern, mm. say, this matter fit no get much attention with the present realities where they're on ground? Mm. Uh -huh. <laughs> you know, eh? Mm. Yeah, so some people go not make we forget minimum wage. Mm. Say, you understand me. True, true. But all that one depends on waiting we, mm. where the trade union leaders mm. eh, and trade unions, mm. And the workers all over the nation do. That's true. If we keep quiet, if we don't talk about minimum wage, they're not going to talk about them now. Exactly. But if we talk about it, it will, it will remain at the front burner of national discourse. That's so true. it is our duty to talk about it. Mm. We, where the leaders don't go come out our eyes from the board, from okay. the target, we're going to talk about it. Minimum wage is our right. Now, law, now law put in. Mm. And everybody must obey. If anybody will not obey them, now, 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 person where they, where they commit a, uh, crime against the law. Okay. Mm -hmm. So okay. we're gonna do something. Okay. I uh, know Wahala comrade uh, Onyeka Oga Chris. We the hell you. Thank you for your time. Uh, for every every way uh, you explain it, give us. We understand God you well. Plenty, plenty, plenty. Make you get better mm. day. Yeah. Okay now.